those of you that don't know me, I'm Al Norman. I'm the F-35 chief test pilot, so the chief pilot for the program. I've been flying on the F-35 and with this helmet for about three and a half years and uh, seen some of our, our uh, growth patterns of the helmet, if you will, through the Gen 2 helmet and what we'll be seeing in the Gen 3 helmet when we start flight testing, as Renan said, in a few weeks out at Edwards Air Force Base. And when we talk about the F-35 aircraft, uh, one of the things that makes that aircraft so unique is, is our integrated uh, sensor fuse systems. Part of the integrated systems is the organic system sitting in the flight suit that we put in the cockpit. Our big connection to the airplane is this helmet. So once I put this helmet on and once I start flying with this helmet, I actually become one with the airplane. This binocular vision helmet gives me that opportunity and gives me the ability to, to be in this world and interact with the airplane in a way I've never had before. It, as I move my head around, just as I'm doing now and looking at everybody, I have complete information in my field of view at all times. I no longer have to look through a HUD field of view, which is a piece of combining glass about so large in front of me, and look through that information. I have information every place I look at all times. And it's not just in this small field of view, it's everywhere I look. It's this large. It's across everywhere that I look in, in my field of view. I also have weapons information, and the one last thing I didn't mention to you was I have a new way to see. I have a new way to look through the eyeballs of the aircraft. And this is fantastic. It gives us capability we've never had before. It gives us the capability to look through our distributed aperture system at the flick of a thumb on one switch to move from that vision in that same field of view and see mid-wave IR view of the world spherically around me, 360 degrees any place I look, and take that information and use that information. What does that do for us? We've already proven it in flight tests. We've already seen it flying. When we fly on dark, dark nights, nights that uh, are, are, are as dark as dark can be, night vision goggles wouldn't work real well, this gas turns night into day. It allows us to fly just like we were in the daytime. <clears throat> to me, to us, that means, that means a, a whole lot because that reduces our workload. That just makes everything so natural we don't think about it. And what we're able to do now is take all of our knowledge that we get from all those other integrated systems and utilize those to the fullest capability. Without this helmet, without that capability, we wouldn't be able to do that. We also have a night vision camera, and you can see that right here, that projects on this, this, uh, this visor, night vision camera on our forehead. And as Renan said, is being improved in the next generation helmet, the Gen 3 helmet gives us night vision capability through a camera also. What we had to do in previous fighters uh, at all times was use night vision goggles. This, this helmet, this capability in the F-35 gives us the ability to switch at will for the best vision possible for the pilot. That, that, that means everything to me. That means I'll be survivable, I'll be lethal, and it's, it's really due to this helmet and the vision that I gain with this helmet. I was curious about it the first time I used it to go, wow, this would be a little bit weird being able to look through the airplane. I love it. I actually love it because um, you can see a depiction here. This is actual DAS video. That is what it looks like. What you get out of it is a tremendous contrast. So you get a very, very good imagery of things all around you. <clears throat> and if you think about it, from an airplane like an F-35 that wants to maintain a stealthier profile, I don't have to maneuver around much. I can just look down and now take a look at them. What's really important to us is our center of gravity for the helmet, the balance of the helmet on our head. I don't lose any of that. So now, even from a safety point of view, whereas it's not real safe for me to, to, to eject if I had to eject with uh, night vision goggles on, this is my helmet. I have everything here. So it's my choice. It's my choice how I see it. It's my choice what I do. And, that, and that actually, uh, as a theme for the F-35, it's my choice what I do with all my information. This is an extension of it. And like I said, <clears throat> when I plug my HVI cable into the aircraft, I truly, I become one with the aircraft.